this crap. What's he got under there anyway? Well, I think I'll just have a little pee. Oh, no! What are you doing near my secret equipment? You have no business snooping around here. Go away! Nah, I'm not snooping. What do you got hiding under there anyway? This is my state-of-the-art equipment that only I know how to operate. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, look, I came here to have a word with you, Don. You better not manhandle me. As you can see, I am an unarmed man. However, I am trained in the classic arts of jiu-jitsu. Ah, don't wet yourself! I, I came to talk to you about my tent and some of that gear of mine that you destroyed this morning. I don't have the slightest idea what you are talking about. <laughs> like I care about your problems? <laughs> what? Are you soft in the head too? No, you know goddamn well what I'm talking about. Now look, uh, I have an itemized list here. It'll show the items that were destroyed or damaged beyond repair, and uh, I would appreciate it if we could just settle the financial aspects of the matter and... Uh... Excuse me? Are you asking Donald Trump Jr. for money? <laughs> I'm asking you to take responsibility for the destruction of my personal property. Now look, I'm in the red here, and someone is going to make good on this, or I'll make such a stink about this whole bullshit operation you got going on here. Donald Trump Jr., the great hunter. Wait till your boys at the country club get an earful of this shit show. <laughs> well... The only problem for you is that you signed a disclaimer. Therefore, you are unable, by law, to disclose any of the adventures that I may have here on the savannah. <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? I don't know anything about a damn disclaimer. Well, perhaps in the future, you'll read the fine print on a contract before you sign it. <laughs> oh, God. Amateur. Now you stay away from my secret things. Go back to the employee camp where you belong. Ah, uh, blow it out your ass! I'm not your goddamn employee! Dale is an old army buddy of mine. He invited me on this trip of a lifetime. I didn't sign a goddamn thing, you rodent-faced little bastard. Now cut me the damn check, or I'm kicking your ass right now. Got that? You wouldn't touch me. My family would sue you for everything you have. Not that you have anything we would possibly want, but we would take it from you anyway. <laughs> And it would be worth every penny to fill my fist, busting your cake hole wide open. <laughs> you think I'm bluffing, Donnie? Huh? <laughs> oh, all right. I'll write you a check later on. I'm busy right now. I'll take the check now, if you don't mind, or else I talk. Besides, I see how forgetful you are. Huh. Oh, all right. Give me your stupid list. But you are playing with fire here, fella. We Trumps don't take kindly to extortion plots, and you will regret what you have done. My father is a very powerful man, and when he finds out about- Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just give me the check, and I'll be on my merry little way. And don't let me catch you around here again. <laughs> You've got a deal. I'll only come around when I need a really good laugh. <laughs> How's that? <laughs> Asshole.